Don't worry, you've got the right show. This is the Superbook show. You've got to wrap this up. The people are waiting for us. Hold on, one second, one second. Okay, I had a question for you anyway. Go for it. So, how do you keep your mind stayed on God? That was random. Where is this coming from? Good question. So I heard this verse, Isaiah 26, 3. It says, He will keep you in perfect peace whose mind is stayed on you because he trusts in you. Oh, I just heard that one too at church on Sunday. Cool. So I want to stay in perfect peace. And this mind thing seems like the key. Well, how do you spend your time? Uh, I don't know. Carefully? N no, what I'm saying is, I see you watch a lot of TV and stuff. Do you make time for God? I, I go to church. Anything else? I say my grace. All good things. I was thinking more like your free time. Do you ever give God some of your free time? I mean, I go, <sighs> no, I don't, not a lot. Well, I would start there. Take some of the time you would spend watching TV, looking at your phone, or playing a game, and try reading your Bible and praying. Yeah, I could do that. Do you think that would help me keep my mind stayed on God? What was the show you were watching? Kids Summer Camp. It's so funny. <laughs> oh, okay. I like that show, too. Do you remember when, in season five, they made the s'mores explode everywhere? Oh, yeah. Love that episode. Remember when Travis tried to make dinner for everyone in the camp, but with no groceries? Yep. Season two, classic. Everyone had to eat spam and tuna. So gross. Remember when they were no, going to- Let me stop you there. I know everything there is to know about that show. I even watched the credits. Did you know that the show's creator also worked on junior high band practice? No, I didn't. But do you see how you know everything about the show? Yeah, I watch it all the time. So is that because your mind is stayed on the show? Oh, yeah, I guess so. I see it now. <laughs> Same with God. You have to do things that involve God to have your mind on God. Like praying, reading your Bible, or singing worship songs. Or watching Superbook. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. I guess I do spend some of my free time with God. Cool. So to keep your mind on God, Try including God things into your daily routine. Try talking to him throughout your day. You can ask him to help you with the test or to have bravery during a game or just to help with activities. When you care about something or someone, you take the time to learn more about them. Do everything you can to get to know God better. Learning more about God will help you keep your mind on him. His word is forever alive. Want to get to know God better? Spend some of your free time at thesuperbookshow.com. Give God your time. Bye. <laughs> what was the show I was watching? <laughs> Hold on. Kids Summer, Kids Kids Summer Camp. Camp. <laughs> <laughs> because you tried, that was right, is it? You will keep him in perfect peace whose mind is stayed on him. On you. On you. You will keep him in perfect peace whose mind is stayed on you because you trust he in trusts him. In because him. he trusts in you. Remember when Travis tried to make groceries for everyone in the camp with, oh, uh, trying to make groceries? To Travis just tried to make groceries. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't try to make groceries.